The Chinese Navy now is basically over 150 uh, naval combatants greater than the U.S. Navy. So this great military growth is largely funded by us. Wall Street, our investors, gave them the money to grow their economy, to build the weapons to kill us. It's not just the PLA by themselves, it's a people's war. So they're engaged with the civilian sector and civilian technology and, and leveraging all of this. James Fennell and Brad Thayer are co-authors of Embracing Communist China, America's Greatest Strategic Failure. Brad Thayer is a senior fellow at the Center for Security Policy. James Fennell is a retired U.S. Navy captain and former director of intelligence and information operations for the U.S. Pacific Fleet. Now it seems like we have people in charge of this progressive movement that are adopting the policies of the Chinese Communist Party. Just look what happened in COVID. Whether communist tyranny wins or, or whether freedom does, of course, is the fundamental issue of this century. This is American Thought Leaders, and I'm Yanya Kellett.